volume, this volume play a hater Creeping out the jungle, it's a silverback gorilla man Beating on my chest, I pull up, then I blow your fucking brains I've made some progress. Yeah, ripped the bumper support out, broke the bolt off for that, but other than that, the bottom's pretty straight. It's just this. And I really don't want to replace it, but if I can't get it pretty straight by yanking it out, I'll probably just have to put in a different core support, which I have one, but I'm trying to avoid that. But I would like to take it for a drive, but I can't. Fan shroud's holding the fan. Surprisingly, that doesn't look like it's busted anywhere. I think the next step's hooking it to a tree or something and try to pull that out as much as possible. Throw my other hood on, get an idea where it's supposed to be. I need to get a new hood latch. It's pretty bent. But yeah, go try and find a shell. Hopefully, with a whole front end on it and everything I need, so I don't have to just piece everything together. Because I'm kind of struggling with that, trying to find a fender and a bumper that matches. I don't really care if it matches, but I prefer it to, but I can't find anything. So <sighs> We'll bring it back to its former glory someday. I couldn't tell you if it's straight or not, but not really. I gotta pull this side a little bit. Hell yeah. This tide's definitely sitting back a little bit, but it actually sticks out more. It's not a big deal. Hell yeah. I'm back. I went and bought a shell. It's got a full villain's angle kit on the front. And I mainly needed it because I wanted the headlight lid and a fender, but I bought the whole car instead. <clears throat> you can see I got the whole car back together pretty much. In the middle doing coilovers and the angle kit, but we'll get back to this in a little bit. In the meantime, I gotta unload this thing. Very sketchily. I don't have any help, so. And this car does not roll very easy, and my driveway is a pretty steep hill. So we're gonna try and unload this thing by pulling out from underneath of it. Hopefully this e-brake works. Good. This could either go very smooth or very bad. I will find out.
So I've managed to pull the core support pretty much straight. I replaced the radiator, the one I had laying around. I had to replace these both sides. I uh, was able to reuse the hood latch by prying it out. Got a new headlight. I kept the same bumper that was on it. This vendor's still pretty clean, but I found a junky one that I could use for now, but that one's got a clean pair of fenders I'm going to put on it instead. Other than that, got some new BC coilovers going on. Got to rip all the ankle kit off of that, throw it on here. Luckily, this car needed tie rods anyway, so might as well upgrade everything, I guess. Gonna stay four lug though. I got some new wheels to put on. Hopefully, get those things on today. But I got some stuff to do, so we'll be back in a little bit. I got it all back together. Went together a lot easier than it did coming apart. I got my what I thought was a clean fender. Isn't the cleanest, but it'll be better than what I had. Matching headlight lid though. So I'm gonna add all the cambies I can get. And then test fit my wheels and adjust right height. I still gotta do the back coilovers, but that can wait. Ball joints are very, very stiff. There we go. Just needed to kick it. It's a tight fit. That one's gonna rub. This one doesn't even sit as low. Whatever though. A little bit better. Still gonna rub, but that's okay. When you pull the fenders on the front of 240s, you tend to get a gap right here. I was trying to avoid that. I don't want to pull them too much. I don't get how this side fits a lot better. And even as low. What a gap though. I don't like that. Ew, that's okay. That is a lot of candy. Look at that. Look at that. My tripod's up, but whatever. I gotta pull it forward into the back now. This right front wheel is not wanting to spin.
Beautiful. One of those is definitely cross thread. <clears throat> come by because that would really suck We're gonna try something new. Oof. Ooh. Sketchy. Battery acts only.
That's definitely not tight. Dang. That's pretty much it. It developed a misfire, which I have to figure out, but other than that, she's sitting pretty good. Now it's time to work on that. Until next time. Mm -hmm.